over 100 protesters representing 350SB.org marched to Santa Barbara on Saturday to send President Barack Obama a message. The message? To reject the proposal to build the Keystone XL oil pipeline through the Midwest. I think the decision the President of the United States is going to make about Keystone will send a global message about the role of fossil fuels in our energy consumption. 350SB.org is a chapter of 350.org whose mission is to raise awareness of the high levels of carbon emissions in our atmosphere. A 90-foot mock pipeline was built and marched from Alameda Park to the beach on Stearns Wharf in protest of the possible decision to build the Keystone XL oil pipeline. It is made of black plastic and um, it is it has an eight inch eight foot circumference, two and a half feet diameter, it's ninety feet long. The pipeline would transport refined oil from the oil sands in Alberta, Canada throughout the US, encouraging more oil to be extracted. The extraction process yields carbon emissions. Ellie Katzenson, City College Associated Student President, attended the protest in support of 350. I want to fight um, climate change in any way that I can. And so at City College, that means me working with a team of students to get our school divested from fossil fuels. Protesters crowded the sidewalks, forcing pedestrians to move aside. This protest is one of many happening throughout the country. While some end in arrests and citations, protesters manage to convey their message with no major predicaments. The most well-behaved protest in uh, adhering to traffic laws I have ever seen in Santa Barbara. While there were many people in attendance, the protest lacked a younger crowd. I'm glad to see some young people. I would like to see more. And I think it was just a little early on a Saturday to do that. Justin Covington for the channels.